everyone and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today we're looking into Cancer's weekly guidance message for July 25th through the 31st. In this message, Cancer, we're going to tap into the energy surrounding you this week. We're going to see what's challenging you this week and where this is headed if you stay in this energy. I'm going to clarify throughout the message. I'll pull a few cards at the end for advice moving forward. If that's something you're interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. Also, guys, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So let's dive in here, Cancer, and see what we can see for your upcoming energy for this week. Most important message here for Cancer Spirit, what do my Cancerian friends need to know? Like you're up in the air about what you should do in regards to a particular person in your life. And I do feel like you feel an intense connection with this particular person. But the underlying energy here, Cancer, is walking away. Okay, so we're going to clarify throughout this message to see exactly what this is pertaining to. But I feel like this is like a rock in a hard spot. Do I stay? Do I go? You feel an intense connection with this person, but it's almost as if this person isn't ready for a the same type of commitment that you are. The energy surrounding you this week, Cancer, the Queen of Cups, the Chariot with the Star Energy, both Cancerian cards. But I feel like you're trying to find a balance. You're trying to keep the peace. You have hope for the situation, but I honestly feel here a little bit of questioning as well. Is this person ever going to change? Are they ever going to give? The challenge here is the connection. Okay, we see the Emperor. We see the King of Cups. We have the Empress. We have the Queen of Cups. So there's definitely an intense connection here. Okay, but I feel that you're kind of like, is this person ever going to change? You know, it's almost as if they're still like playing the field the outcome here cancer and I feel like this is why you're getting ready to walk away is because this person isn't ready to change it's almost as if this person is showing up as a page and you're showing up as an empress and that's why you guys aren't being able to connect that's why you guys aren't being able to come together on a common ground, on a common level. So let's clarify for you, Cancer. Now, if you find the messages helpful or resonating, please give it a thumbs up. We're going to clarify the Queen of Cups, the Chariot with the Star Energy for Cancer. Please and thank you. Do my Cancerian friends need to know? So a lot of watching, a lot of waiting. I definitely feel like there's an energy of loss abandonment like you feel like you're going to abandon this person if you leave but I definitely feel like there's a need to set boundaries um, when it comes to what exactly it is and boundaries aren't necessarily setting with another person to try and control that person when we set boundaries how I try to explain it to my clients is we're setting the expectation with the universe of what we will accept in our lives and what we won't accept in our lives and this is on for any person that enters into our life, it's not with one particular person or another. 
when we communicate those boundaries to a person, that's when the person could feel like it's trying to control. But I honestly feel like you're setting the expectation with the universe, you know? And if that's something that you won't accept in your life, that's definitely something that needs to be communicated. What I feel like is coming out is this person is still playing the field, keeping their options open. And you're hoping that this person has a shift in perspective, but it's not happening. Or it's happening very slowly. But we see that they're keeping their options open. This is part of the challenge. One of you is keeping your options open and one of you wants to make this work. So let's clarify this page of cups, the three of cups with the empress energy. You have a decision to make, Cancer. You kind of have to accept this person as they are and change your expectations with the universe or walk away from this connection because it's no longer serving you. And it's going to be difficult because you do feel an intense connection with this person. Um, but it's definitely what needs to take place in order to protect your energy. Now, because the connection is so intense, this person could come back around. Uh, but they're going to have to make a lot of changes in their life before they're going to be ready for what it is that you're ready for. So let's pull a few cards out here for your advice, guidance moving forward, Cancer. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. Is that page of swords again? So a lot of watching, a lot of waiting. I feel like what needs to take place, Cancer, is just focusing on your own energy, your own priorities, your own stability, and looking at this person very practically. And what position are you going to want to give this person in your life, if any at all? Or are you going to want to take some distance, some time from this connection to really get clear on your path, your next move? I definitely feel like there is an ending coming in. It might not happen this week, but I feel like it's coming here soon. Okay, so preparing for this is going to be important because this is a tower moment. This is something that's unavoidable, but you can soften the blow by preparing pull a soul truth message and guys this is only resonating for those of you that you feel an intense connection with this person but they're not changing What expectations do I have that are impossible to meet? The expectations we have are mostly delusional and impossible to meet. We then experience disappointment within ourselves or with a relationship when we are not, when they are not met. It's time to dissolve your expectations and replace them with gratitude. Today's soul action, be grateful. You are being summoned to more peace. Peace is home for your soul and it is accompanied by trust. It comes when you surrender and focus only on what you can control. If you expect nothing and are grateful for everything, you will experience extreme fulfillment. So maybe your perspective might need to shift with this connection a little bit, but I honestly feel here Cap Cancer, Capricorn, I almost said Capricorn, so you could be dealing with the Capricorn. But I honestly feel here cancer that there is a need to get clear on what you will and won't accept in your life and if this person isn't in alignment with that then then you're going to need to let this person go if you feel like you can shift your perspective and you can accept this person as they are without wanting them to change or shift their energy then by all means it will work it can work uh, but it's going to take a shift in perspective or a shift in environment is the only two ways that this is going to change so cancer i feel like that's a good solid message coming out for you guys thank you guys again for all the love and support and i look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon
Namaste.